Hello guys, here I will show you how to uh, partitionate um, 100 floppies in your USB pen drive. So first you have to download this program on internet, you can find it with the name. Just uh, typing on Google batch manage tool v1.40 and you will find it for sure okay once you have it you just have to extract it okay and well it's now the time to install the program you know so let's click on it let's click on run Uh, English here next only I will change the location so I will just delete this part from here to program files and then once you have it like that next so it will appear in the C folder next and install it's really fast so it's done finish here and it's done now we have to go to the C hard drive to find the um, the, the app and you can see that it's not here now, it's now here, USB Flop Emulator B2. Now we have to run it from here. That's it. So double click on USB Floppy Manager. And we are here. Now you have to be sure that the, hard, the USB stick or the, pre or the pen drive that you find is this one. You can see the name here. Okay, beware to delete something that you to format something that you will not want to lost. Be sure it's the one that you have to you want to delete or to use. Now when you do click on format, you will get this screen. And it's almost everything set up, you know. You have to be sure that it's the 100 blocks or floppy disk here. It's the maximum amount that you can do it with this program. And begin to format. This can uh, take a little time, you know, but be sure, please, that you don't uh, choose the wrong one. In my case, is that E, my pen drive. Okay, and now I will have the 100 floppy disk in the screen, like like this. Now there's a, there's another step that you will have to do. What happened that if you don't do it, maybe you open one disk, one diskette here, and will appear maybe your documents, you know? So in the file, where is the root of the program, you just create a, a new folder, and you have to rename it to disk. Now you do a new, an, another one that is going to call, to be called a disk back like this now you will have to come back to the app and set it go to options here to set and be sure that the 
uh, upload file root directory is in the right uh, location you know in this case disk if not you have to do it from here okay you click ok and that's it same with the backup file root directory you click here if it's not there in the disk back and you set it here okay and then you click ok and that's it then uh, now you have to well just close this window you know i will not do it with cancel now you open one diskette and you will get a window of that diskette this is a zero 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 well first you can see here is empty now for the moment okay now you click on here you will have the open disk here you can see zero 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 and now you will see here that it was created the e folder and inside the e folder is a floppy zero 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 And well, you can do it with another one, I don't know, the 7 for example. Okay, zero, zero, 007. Or maybe the no zero, zero, 001. And well. Here you will be able to see them now inside the e carpet here. Now in options you can change the view also. But I prefer not like this, I prefer it like this. So I will keep it in this way. And well, this is the thing that you have to do. Now you can emulate the 100 diskettes. And well, uh, well, ah, actually, if you click on backup, it's going to create a backup of the diskettes. Like this. You see, now you have the 100 diskettes here. And well, well, if you have a question, write it in the comments. Um, I hope this video helped you. And if you like it, please, maybe you can give me a like, a thumb up, and also subscribe for more videos. Thank you for watching.